Hello and welcome back to Two Dudes One Dredge. We're just a couple of miners in Alaska that do small scale mining with a six inch dredge from Keene. And today we're doing something a little different. We're heading up to some new untested ground and poking around with a pan, a shovel, and a metal detector and documenting what we find. And hopefully it's good because we plan on moving our dredge up here eventually and putting in some work. So. Uh, thanks for following us along. We just recently, as a, as of this recording, passed 1,500 subscribers, which is a crazy milestone for us. We certainly never thought that uh, so many people would be interested in what we do here and wanted to follow us along. And we can't thank you enough for watching and subscribing and checking things out. And uh, if you're new here and you like what you see, feel free to join in. And uh, we'll be doing this until... Heck, we're out of dirt or out of gold. Which one comes first? Who knows? But uh, either way, thank you very much. And a big extra special thank you to our patrons over on patreon.com slash 2D1D uh, for supporting us in addition to watching these videos. We can't thank you guys enough. Uh, we'll be doing more gold giveaways as the months roll on here. The next one is uh, September 1st, so if you want to get in on that, feel free to check out our Patreon page. But... Uh, here we are in the Yetna Mining District today, a uh, historic gold mining district in Alaska, part of the gold rush in the early 1900s, and a reported 200,000 ounces of gold came out of this area. And that's just reported. You know, some of that was just pocketed, taken home, and never spoken about again. So uh, we're here to get a little bit of it and see how we do, but... We are definitely pushing our limited experience and our limited manpower moving the six inch dredge around. We're willing to give it a try. So, uh, thanks as always for watching and enjoy the beautiful sights here as James drives in on Petersville Road to uh, check out our new claim. All right, so we got exciting news. We're up here uh, quite a bit farther in the mountains than we usually go because we, uh, we bought a new claim this year. So this is our first time uh, coming up and checking it out. It was a, a pretty hairy trail to get in here in the Tacoma, but we made it. Yeah. And uh, I'm sure we'll make it out with Brennan, our driver. <laughs> we'll see. But we're going to go over here and just uh, kind of bushwhack over to the creek, see how, how it looks, and we'll let you guys in on what we find. All right. James is getting a pan in, just poking around on this nice little gravel bar. I'm getting some uh, metal detecting going, but I'm not seeing any exposed bedrock or interesting like places that would be easy to metal detect. So I might switch over to panning with James and nice little creek though. It's pretty quick through here. So all the fine gold might blow all the way downstream, but doesn't mean there won't be some nice chunky stuff up here somewhere. Guess we'll find out. And just, by the way, look at this unbelievable view. Sun just tucked behind the uh, hillside over here, but holy cow. Beautiful. All right, so I was walking along the new claim and we found this old jar half kind of in the settled into the ground on the tundra here and it looks like it's got a document with writing on it inside. <laughs> Jars maybe, rusted shut. Maybe we'll take it back to camp and Try to get it open and dry it out and see if there's anything. Oh, there's a crack in the bottom. So right. Water got in. Sure. Well, let's let it dry before we. That's a modern document. It's printed. I bet you it's just uh, claim information for. Somebody? Someone up here, hmm. yeah. Very strange. 
All right, so you guys remember we found that jar up on our new claim, had some paper in it. We dried out the paper, kind of turned to pulp. Uh, it looks like it's a printed document, so it's not super old. And I can just see something where it says Fairbanks map search. So probably somebody's mining registration, From claim registration documents. Some modern era when printers existed. But yeah. Yeah. Shame. The mystery lives on. Right. All right, guys. So we walked the claim top to bottom and did a couple of test pans and swung the metal detector around. Nothing crazy happened, of course, but every pan had a couple of fly poops and that's just surface gold. So once we find our lowest impermeable layer, hopefully that leads to some good dredgeable ground here shortly. So we'll keep you updated with the new claim and uh, yeah, I'm still pretty excited.